Chaplo Cree First Nation has been providing homes for its people on reserve since 1991, when construction of the first homes began. Since then, members of Chaplo Cree First Nation have been striving to provide safe and rapid housing to the community as swiftly as possible to help address the shortage of housing. The community wasted no time when it came to jumping onto a project designed to bring rapid housing projects to their community to help address the housing shortages. This build helped provide the community with six housing units that are safe for families. When I saw the rapid housing and it was an opportunity to jump on multiple, multiple units for a short period of time, so I jumped into the first round of applications. Um, fortunately, they didn't have enough money so they had put a bunch of applications on hold and we were invited back to submit for the second round. Um, so I was quite excited to get that invitation to resubmit under round two. Obviously we were successful in getting our funding for round two, which is fantastic. I mean, that was, I think I was jumping up and down that day. <laughs> the completion of this housing project was a huge accomplishment. The members are extremely proud of their accomplishment and hope to see rapid housing initiatives take place in other First Nations communities. Groundwork began on May 3rd on the two triplexes, six units in total. Crews encountered tons of rock and bedrock in the only area large enough to construct the two buildings. Making plans on the fly, by shifting and adjusting, they were able to get the foundation set. From there, the project took off. Each triplex was six sections in size and were set into place within one day. Due to the style of the units, the roof was required to be constructed on site for both buildings. The completion of these modular builds had a huge impact on the community as it helped construct multiple units in under six months. I've left my mark in, in many ways over the course of the years, but this is tangible. This is something that I can see all my hard work coming to fruition. And when you see, when you show a tenant around and you hand over the keys, it's a feeling like no other. Knowing that you're helping a young family get started. Or, you know, seniors that need a place to stay or people that don't have a home or are underhoused. That feeling of satisfaction makes all these extra, all these extras um, definitely worthwhile. It's, it's, it's such a sense of pride. The first time I drove by there and I saw all the lights on, I think I had tears in my eyes. This goes to show what can be accomplished by throwing your hat in the ring and thinking outside the box. Great job, Chaplow Cree First Nation.